here we go. Ready? Ready? We ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for some Stray Kids, baby. Let's do Stray Kids. Yeah. Okay. Whew. What is happening, my friends? Today we're checking out some Stray Kids. This is their most recent single. It's called Maniac. I have not heard it yet, but I'm really excited to. Um, yeah, I put this on the poll before they even released the song. Because <laughs> I knew... I knew I was going to want to watch it. I was hoping people would vote for it. And they did. So, excellent. Let's get into it. Hey, good start with the weird sounds. Let's go! Hey. Okay, hold on, hold on before we go further because we know that Stray Kids can just like at the, the snap of a finger just change it all up. New beat for them, man. I don't know if I've ever heard them do something so horny. <laughs> that Let's use another word for that. So full of wind instrument sounds. <laughs> um, yeah, dude, that like really sort of like it's going in and out. Obviously, the volume, they've got like sort of like a thing where it's like, you know, it kind of goes in and then out. And you only hear it sometimes. But uh, Stray Kids, I'm so used to having more of like a consistent like um, not horns. I don't really I haven't heard them use horns very much. It's, it's a really cool, cool sound, too. It's like really it's not just a couple notes. It's like a full riff, you know? You know, like there's a lot to it. It's like its own, it's its own melody. All right, one more time. I, I wanted to go back to this anyway. This, this dance is absolutely ridiculous. What happened? I'm on a keyboard. You gotta love that. <laughs> that part right there. <laughs> And that, I wanted to mention that, man. That that run right there, dude, that caught me off guard. Yeah. All right. Hey, Egyptian scale coming in. Hey. Oh. Hold up. Oh my god. Yo, um, first of all, let me just say, this is like the slowest I've ever heard this guy rap. It's kind of cool. You know, like usually he's just like flying at the speed of sound. You know what I mean? He's kind of held himself back a little bit on this one. Sounds really good when he's kind of slowing it down a little bit too. Um, I've heard him go slow. I'm, I'm exaggerating a little bit, obviously. But I love, uh, like I said, I, I kind of felt that this, there was going to be a big shift as soon as it ended. That horn kind of disappeared, went into a different scale. Like, Egyptian scale here. And the whole first part was like major, and this is suddenly not. How that happens, <laughs> I just don't know. Hey. hey, there's the horn back. Wow, this is pretty sick, man. Yo, I haven't even figured out what the chorus is yet, honestly. Like, when, when Felix came in and did the really deep part, that's when it started to get, like, okay, so... That, that sort of bass line that was underneath it was so Stray Kids. Like, it was, like, real thick and, like, made you kind of, like... Like, Felix's voice sounds so good over those thick bass lines because it's so deep. It's, like, this really... This doubling of, of deep sounds that just creates this sort of, like... 
I don't know, rounded sort of like really uh, like it feels good in your ears, man. I don't know. Is that ASMR? I, I think he's giving me some ASMR accidentally right there. But then they came back in with that the sort of like major, like the catchy melodic sort of um horn sound, which I I, I kind of thought we were going to be done with for the rest of the song. I'm really glad they brought it back in. And we're halfway through the song, and we haven't repeated a part yet, which is also really cool. <laughs> This must be the chorus. Yo, their bass line, man. I'm saying, they come up with the best bass lines. I also like, by the way, if you like listen to it, it's like, um, they combine that bass line right there with a percussion sound. It sounds like every time they hit a bass, they're also hitting something percussive that's making the bass sound harder, right? Like almost like a click, almost like you hear a click when it when you hear each bass note. I'm trying to figure out actually how they did that. <laughs> I think it's just the style of bass that they have on the synthesizer that they're using, but it sounds really cool. It sounds like sharp. At bridge time. I'll always love his voice the most, I think. <laughs> I think I always will. Yo, I also love their ad-libs, man, like, because they have so many guys that are capable of rap, it seems like they all just throw in ad-libs whenever they feel like it, and it always enhances, like, it always makes it feel like there's, like, by the end of the song, you hear a lot of them, right? So it's like, it gets fuller and fuller and bigger and, and, and more cohesive as the song goes on. I've noticed them doing that in quite a few of their songs, they're really good at that, too. I really like Stray Kids. Obviously, I'm fanboying a little bit here. I, like, I know that that's happening. I just really like their music, and I I really like the uh, the writer. Like, I know that they write a lot of their own music. Like, the Three Racho, right? I think it's called. I think that they're... Even though they're super popular... Stray Kids is one of the most popular K-pop groups out there right now. Um, I think that maybe the their writing ability goes under the radar a little bit. Like, I don't ever really hear people talk about that. And I think that they should a lot. Like, it's probably, like, well, they're one of the best writers when it comes to K-pop groups. <laughs> Producers, also. <laughs> Alright, you hear those secondary synthesizer in there, too? What just happened? Oh, is that the end of it? Wow. What a sudden end, man. That came out of nowhere. All right, hold on. Talk to <laughs> it really does sound like that's the sound of it, too. Why are you looking at me like you're angry, bro? Come on, I like you. I love that one. That was, uh, that's the top, I don't know, out of all the Stray Kids songs I've listened to. And I did a full on deep dive stream on them, uh, where I just listened to Stray Kids. They are, um, that was, that was like a top, definitely top half, probably top 20% 
of the songs that I've heard from them. I really like that, man. I love the fact that I didn't know what, what the chorus was until the second time that the chorus showed up. It just goes to show you how many parts of the song that they wrote. And they all felt cohesive. None of it felt jarring, like it was out of place or anything. Like I said, they do do things where they intentionally want it to feel a little bit jarring, where they go from, like, one uh, section to another section. Um, but not not in a way that it's not cohesive. You know they're intentionally trying to do that because it's the style, right? Like, I could feel it coming before it came, and then it came, and it felt good, right? <laughs> Damn. I, the words that I'm using right now need to be replaced by less sexual words. I understand that. I'm going to try to do that. But uh, 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 just uh, when it comes to Stray Kids, my mind just disappeared, man. My mind just disappeared. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I'm back. What the, the best part of this was that I really didn't know where it was going to go. And by the time it got to where it was going to go, I felt really, really good about it. Um... And I dug the sound of the song, man. Like, when they came in with the Egyptian scale, that was the last thing that I expected. Just because there, it wasn't there before. And it sounded, like, way happier, the part before that showed up. So when that came in, you get that new section. And then they, and then they kind of did that thing where they did it in, um, like, Easy. The song Easy. It's Easy, right? I think it was Easy. Um, where it's just the bass in the chorus. I like when they do that, too. When it's just the bass. The bass carries it so far because the the sounds that they use are so good like the the production right the production just sounds so good overall so when it's just the bass and like you know one of the members like like felix just go maniac you know <laughs> like it sounds like asmr to me i don't know about you guys <laughs> 